All right, we're in Taiwan. Yeah, let's do this. Happy fun time, Lance. Get some nice little dresses. China has the best dresses I've heard. Oh my god! Oh my god, it's a rabbit head. It's a very sexy dress. I've never been so physically attracted to a bunny. Yeah, absolutely. I've never been so repulsed by a hot woman. Start your engines, people. They're racing you know, they're for just victory. Trying to go to work. Yo! That's being yo, racist. No, no. Go, 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 go. Who's gonna make it? Who's gonna make it? I got 50 on yellow. Oh no, yellow just fell over. All right, it is now dinner time in Taiwan. This is our first meal being in this country, and uh, once again we find ourselves at this restaurant. We were here last time. We we actually went twice last year because it was so good. Uh, if you're not familiar with Din Tai Fung, it's a dumpling place. They make the most delicious soup dumplings ever, which are pretty much these little pork and vegetable dumplings that have like literally like soup in them. So that you have to be careful that you don't burn your mouth off when you bite into them. We eat our own. Is where we feast. That's feast mine. of the gods. Mine. We each get our own. Yeah. We literally ordered one per person. So this is mine. Goodbye, little dumplings. You were you get were cute belly. while you lasted. Get in my belly. We got some uh, fungus soup right here. Looks delicious. <laughs> Mr. Lamb can't wait to eat it. In fact, he loves it so much he's gonna eat mine too. So now we're at the Guanghua Digital District. Uh, it's a six floor building and every floor is littered with tech stores. They sell everything from motherboards to video cards, USB flash drives, video games. I mean, everything is here. It's pretty ridiculous. We're gonna go to the top floor right now because that's where I hear, that's what Paul said is the, where the cheapest stuff is, right? Oh, yeah, that's where the cheapest stuff is. Cheapest stuff. Pretty sweet Kingston ad. They, uh, they're offering 100% compatibility, eight gig chocolate chips. <laughs> <laughs> so Paul and I just bought some LEDs for dirt cheap. These are like four or five bucks a pop. I got two of these uh, double width purple ones. Uh, purple LEDs are kind of rare in America, so thought I would uh, stock up on those. And I got one double white LED. Okay. Paul got uh, he got he got a variety of colors. What'd you get, Paul? I got a couple. So I, I still have some left over from last year. So I'm 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 good at, on blues. I have, still have quite a few blues left. And I think think I might be down to like one white. So I got a couple more reds. A couple more whites, and then I got a purple as well, um, kind of, kind of like, kind of like Cadley, because it's the color of royalty. This one's a double, so it's got this one has more LEDs on it, so it gives kind of a more, like a more uniform lightedness. To and, and you were looking for greens for like a while, and the guy had no we're greens check at all. If they have greens down here, because apparently maybe Nvidia builds are just that popular. Yes. Um, and greens are harder to come by. Come by. So uh, if you're wondering who knows how to do water cooling the best. It's definitely Taiwan. I think that means water closet. Kyle. No, it's definitely water cooling, Paul. Okay. It's cooling it, but it's... But it'd be urine cooling. Well, it was water at some point. It's going up into him, it looks like. I've never seen so much storage capacity in such a small space. Look at those hard drives. Jesus. Jesus! <laughs> Everything on this store is on sale right now, 50% off. Come on down, you're gonna love it. So there's a ton of family fun friendly things you can find in Taiwan. Uh, Paul, demonstration please. Kyle, which, which way does this thing go again? It... Oh my god, oh my god, do not do that. Are you serious? This thing is dope. Hey guys, Paul here. Uh, Kyle asked me to hold his phone for him. I'm not sure why though, he said he had something to take care of, but... Um... Anyway, I wonder where Steve went off to. Taiwanese breakfast. So I'm gonna see what's inside of this Chinese pizza really quick. I'm gonna dissect it. So on the top layer, we've got kind of like a green onion pancake, followed by some egg, some fried egg, with uh, some some basil as well as some chopsticks that need to get out of here. Get, 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 get. You get some basil, fresh basil. I saw the lady pick it right off the leaf, or this is the leaf. She picked it right off the plant. Super fresh. And then this like kind of creamy gooey sauce that uh, is tangy and sweet and delicious. It's kind of tomatoey and it's a bit spicy, but not too much. It's just A1 sauce. It's A1 sauce. It's steak sauce. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding, guys. We're at Sizzler right now. Oh, really? Yeah. It's a conspiracy. No, no, I just feel like I'm so used to seeing it. It's a pulp. So in America, when you're sick, they have Tylenol. And in Taiwan, when you're sick, they have lizard on a stick. Meat market. Lots of meat. That is a lot of noodles. Mother of God. Oh, that looks amazing. Wow. I just want to jump right in there and swim in it. Eat my way out. Taiwan really knows their sports. You got soccer. It's a soccer bag with a basketball flying up in the air and a bunch of hexagons. More yeah. Taiwanese breakfast adventures.
We got dumplings this time. Those look amazing. And we also got these little uh, rice, sticky rice pork wrap things. So we do, we eat which also look super good. In the morning. You eat it with some. Uh, because uh, I think that's vinegar. We are too busy. Usually we skip for Something. lunch. And uh, there's also a straw. We got a straw. One and a half. Why, why are you showing me a straw, Paul? Uh, because these are special straws. They're angled so that you can go like this. They don't have that in the States. You, can you stop being so violent, please? Thank you. First person stabber. Guy, what do you think of the uh, metro transit system here in Taiwan? I think it sucks. That's not... That, you're wrong. Please explain, explain to me what will happen in this sign back here. Obviously, uh, the cigarette is crying because the food and the drink here uh, have like a, an unrealized like a love for each other. They're trying to work out. So um, I think I think the cigarette okay. was fapping. Oh, yeah. What the fuck are you doing? That's not true at all. Hey, what's going on? Hey, uh, Why are we all? What's going? On? Uh, hey. hey. Uh oh. Okay. I'm filming you, filming her, filming me, filming you. It's a love triangle. So we're at a bar right now called Foreplay, and I apologize for it being way too dark in here. But uh, it's a very unique bar where you can actually order different types of drugs. I don't mean actual literal drugs, literal drugs, but they uh, they basically model their cocktails after certain certain uh, certain uh, substances. So Paul over here got marijuana, that big old stoner, and as you can see, oh that's nice. Thank you for the light, Mr. Lamb. Um, it's, it's actually really nice looking. Uh, it's a shot with some dry ice in it. I don't know what exactly the fluid is in there, but uh, it looks it looks quite tasty, and I'm sure it has some serious after effects. Rachel's first time doing cocaine, everyone. Oh yeah. And it like a champ. Oh, you got a nice little placement in case you mess up. Wow, he's gonna rack it up. He's gonna rack it up on the plate for you and everything. He's got a flammable material completely around the thing. He's gonna light on fire. <laughs> now, Rachel, you know not to snort it, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. okay. So cinnamon. Wow. It's on fire. <laughs> oh, that's sick. Oh, that's, oh, awesome. that's really cool. What? All right, now drink it. <laughs> no. Whoa. <laughs> That's amazing. I don't even know what's happening right now. Cinnamon on the... Wow. Yeah. It's like a banana sauce. <laughs> yeah. It's like doing cocaine on 4th of July. Oh, it smells so good. It smells really good. Oh, yeah. and he traps it. He traps it all. I take the sauce. You take it off. Okay. okay. Oh, you drink it right when oh, it takes it right off. drink it right away? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Are you ready? Leave a little bit. Okay. Right. Go. Go. Go, 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 go. Whoa. Yeah. Alright Kyle, you're about to embark on a nice little journey called heroin. Yes I am. Let's do this. Put it in your mouth, Kyle. And then the next one? Yeah. Interesting. I smell heroin. <laughs> No, nail that shit. That was delicious. Now do I drink this? Yeah. Just don't drink the solid. <laughs> don't drink the solid. <laughs> and don't let it touch your lips. Nice. Yeah, like a bowl. Yeah, like a mouse. Yeah. Like a mouse. That's how you do heroin, kids. <laughs> Stay in school. So we're at uh, the Ximending District, where there's a lot of shopping and food, and Rachel got a shaved ice, mango shaved ice which looks very delicious. She's gonna taste test it for me right now while she does something very creative with the straw. Sing, you bastard, sing! What is this, chocolate? Yes. I guess this is some Japanese chocolate that uh, Steve just bought. We're at the... It's very soft. The texture is amazing. What's the name of the airport? Nikita? Um, we're at La Femme Nikita Airport. La, La Femme? Well, that... you said Nikita, which is where Narita. <laughs> Narita. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's what I said. International airport in Tokyo. Yes. It's actually yes. just outside of Tokyo. That's right. Paul's been to Japan before, so he's a veteran. 
Um, Cal, if you give me a second, I will uh, provide you with some additional voiceover because I'm going to do a video too. Okay. Does that voiceover come with a happy ending? Of course we're in it Asia. Does. Uh, there's the chocolate that Steve got. I'm waiting to try it. I'm sure it's going to be very delicious. But uh, we're waiting for a transfer plane right now. We're on our way back to LAX, and the trip's over. So, I thought I would just close it out with Are you doing the end of your video right now? I am doing the end of my video right now. This is the end of my video. Wow, we're going to have some uh, overlap there. But uh, thank you guys for watching the video. Stay tuned for no more vlogs in the near future because I'm going back home and I'm staying home for a while. But uh, you might be going to uh, Korea. I'm not going... What? They're trying to send you to Korea. I heard that only you were going to go to Korea with They're Nick. They're trying to send two people. Uh, we'll have to find out when we get back. I'm not going to Korea. It's only for like a day and a half. Wait, it's, it's, it's South Korea, right? Thank you guys for watching, though. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Like the video. I'll see you guys in the next one.